Oh yeah. Umbrella core. Umbrella core. I like really dumb achievements. Okay, I take it back. Achievements aren't just stupid. Sometimes they can be interesting. More often than not, they are stupid though. <laughs> I've said this many times, achievements can help guide the player to playing in different playstyles and find interesting mechanics that they wouldn't have otherwise figured out. Maybe not mechanics, but just uh, like stuff. And I'm not talking about like collectible achievements. Collectible achievements are the worst. That's like the laziest type of achievement. Big agree? Yeah. yeah, yeah. There's also silly ones. Silly ones are fun sometimes too, but I keep clicking online almost. <laughs> Uh, what if, what if I bought all y'all, not all of y'all, you know, you know, <laughs> you guys know which ones I'm talking, or which ones, which of you I'm talking to. Bought y'all this game, and then we played that for a game night one time online. As far as I know, the online still works, it's just, <laughs> it's just whatever. Okay, so we finished a dependable weapon last time. So we have one, two, three, four, five. We have six levels left. Walking threat. I would play. This one's mine. <laughs> Multiplayer is marginally. It's like a little better. Oh my gosh, I only have to do one mission. Oh, baby. It's not going to be an easy one, but. This mission is a pure test of survival. Who will be left standing? The mutant or the subject? Can't wait to find out. No, yeah, no. That is that is what I meant when I said, like, I hard agree with what you're talking about with achievements, that they're just generally just there to, like, have your neurons fire off and be like, I, <laughs> ooh, I get thing. You may, you may or may not have noticed, it's actually been a while since I've played anything on this PS4, but I turn on my achievement notification off on that because it's just it's so distracting. <laughs> I actually might want to do that on Steam. There's like a sound effect that plays now uh, since one of their recent updates. Be good to get rid of that. Get the special infected DNA sample. I, de I feel like it's definitely like something you can hear on stream, but you guys have told me multiple times that you can't hear it. But I'm not sure if that's just because they added it while I was playing Elden Ring. And Elden Ring, every single achievement, you're usually after you fight something is what they're for. <laughs> so like there's like the loud like <laughs> so it like completely drowns out that sound effect. Ow. Where is the special effect? <laughs> How am I gonna fight him if I don't know where he is? The birds! Don't, don't talk about my aim, Chad. <laughs> you don't know how hard it is to aim in this game. Is that him? That's it! Him, boys. Rattle them. I should have thought my, thrown my grenades first. It's too late now. It doesn't work. The counter didn't work. He's not eating it, Jack. It, it, it despawned. Oh, thank you, dog. Oh, that was it. <laughs> oh, I gotta do it three times. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Uh, be better if I killed you guys, because you're going to keep chasing me, I'm pretty sure. Oh, there's the guy. There's the dog. Got that dog in me. Oh, I think I got to, like, counter him. Like, time it right. Fuck, dude. Damn. Can thing be shiny? I don't even know which thing we're talking about anymore. Cringe. <laughs> Dying is pretty cringe. Rip. <laughs> it sounded like it was down there, but I don't... You know what? I... I'm a fool for thinking there's any sort of design or... Exactly. Oh, you got it! Fuck! 
<laughs> scared the shit out of me. This one's mine. This one's mine. Sample retrieved. Now, does he summon out of that same pool, or do I have to find him somewhere else? No, yeah, his, his pool dissolved. Doggies. I think that might be him over there. The important thing is to not get flanked by other enemies. Fuck. That's bad. Oh, this is happening. <laughs> the important thing is to not get flanked by enemies. Let me show you. No! Damn it, bird, go away. Alright, one more, one more, one more. Could use some ammo, but... There's ammo. It's, that is him. Oh fuck, he saw me. Oh fuck, a bird. Dude, it doesn't work sometimes. Sometimes it works and I like dodge his damage, but sometimes it just doesn't work. No, the bird! <laughs> you bird! <laughs> He does not like your vibes. Damn. It's like, oh, it's only one mission, it'll be fine. Imagine having other stuff after this, though. You know? Oh, that's really bad. Shit. Uh, okay. Bird Demic. Like that the birds are more dangerous, yeah. It's kind of the biggest bullshit ever. Uh, I will say, the last level is a nightmare, but I think there's no flying enemies. I might be misremembering, though. Instead, there's just like hella enemies everywhere, so it's. You know. But. Oh. Shit. I mean, that seems like the ideal strat, actually. You just hit them till they fuck. Hit them till they fuck. Oh, there's nothing there. I was hoping I'd get either ammo or herb. I got neither. Oh, shit. Is that him? What are you? Oh. Yeah, it's him. Damn it, dude. What the hell, dude? It didn't work! I, like, peppered his face with the bullets, and he's like, nah, I don't care. Oh, shit, you're alive! Need to heal. Before a bird just comes and clips me. Oh! Yep, like this. Honestly, killing them doesn't really matter. <laughs> What are you doing with this cover? Give me a thing. There we go. It took longer than it should have, but it wasn't that bad. So many businessmen. It's Raccoon City, baby. It was three minutes faster than my old time. God damn. Alright, so that was Walking Threat. Confined Struggle. We're going to test CQBZ to its limits. There's no better place than here. 
One room, plenty of zombies, and places to cover yourself. Uh, let's start, re start off with reducing your ammo, shall we? So I got called by my supervisor and told me... He told me that they were going to triple my contract payment, and upon successful completion of the trials, I'd get a special bonus. I wanted no part of this, but it could end up being my big chance. Oh yeah, we got immediately three things. Okay, cool. Samples, briefcases, dot. Domination is the last one's the worst. Another splendid replica, very high quality, though it does differ from the real RPD in very in a few in a few ways. Zombies are authentic enough. Watch your step. Isn't there a Resident Evil movie where, like, everything takes place inside a simulation? I think that is actually one of them. <laughs> I've only watched the first three, though, so I don't... I don't know. They've reduced me ammo! What? How did I miss both of you? Oh nice, one of them dropped an herb. Herba. Fuck! This one's mine. Dickhead. Did I not just see an herb two seconds ago? Oh, it's over here. What the fuck, dude? One of these hit this one's mine. It's not even a hitbox issue, it's like a some kind of skill issue or something. This one's mine. There it is. I don't know if it would be worth to like get a zombie shield or not. I also don't know what causes the prompt to show up, so I'm never ready to press it when it happens. Oh. There it is. What? Stomp him! Oh my god, they're all dropping fucking herbs. What's going on? Sample obtained. Nope. Nope. I survived! I didn't even see that lady, Jesus. <laughs> Domination is going to be rough in this level, especially if I have reduced ammo. <laughs> Ugh. Hopefully the briefcases won't be too bad. We may find ourselves doing this mul multiple times just because... That whole dying thing. Wait, I got a grenade. A lot of crawling zombies here. Definitely not helpful to my survival. Well, I didn't kill anything. That's unfortunate. <laughs> oh, she's, she's facing me. Alright. Easy enough. Just like that, there's... It's all my ammo. Screwing around afterwards, just firing off randomly. <laughs> God. So dense in here. Could you not start with like six crawling zombies around me? That'd be fucking really cool. Dude, what the hell? I'm gonna play this safe. As safe as I can, at least. I don't know. Traffic, they don't seem to aggro, that's good. From here, at least. I wonder what that gun is behind me. Don't walk over here. Stop! Lady! What? She alerted the others! What is this bullshit? Got a blast! No! What? You're not dead! Why aren't you dead? 
Dude! Keep getting like bad hits or something. I don't know. Fuck, man. Maybe I forgot about melee because it just gets bad as you get further in. The zombies just have more health or something. Oh, shit, they know. Come on, get up. Oh. You bitch! Fucking reach me somehow. Oh, shit, that's a guy. Okay, back over here. There are so many of you over here now. Fuck! I wish my melee worked! Really? Not a single herb from any of you? Last one, right? Yeah, last one. Okay, good. Dude, this fucking bullshit. At least there's an herb in here. That's super helpful, actually. Five seconds. Grabbing the herb. Yeah, bitch! I think we beat our time, but not by, like, a ton. Hmm. Never mind, two whole minutes. <laughs> I'll take it. I think there's one more in the RPD, and then we're... Damn, alright, cool. It's good. Yeah, Raccoon City is, like, the shitty one, honestly. <laughs> I mean, the end is also very hard. Yeah, okay, I remember this one. That's probably a bad sign. <laughs> Plenty of noisy guests today. The engineers have various uh, farm companies breathing down their necks. They came to check up on us or on things personally. That's to be expected. After all, today we're going to be testing the results of something very important. The zombie jammer has jammer. <laughs> zombie jammer has been completed. Uh, it robs the infected of their uh, perception senses. However, we haven't explored the possible side effects on regular humans. It's not a stretch of the imagination to think it could cause brain damage. So level zombie jammer. Banana slammer. We got three of these. Okay. Well, at least domination's the second one this time. Here, I've got a new toy for you. With this, you should be able to tidy up that cesspool of infected in no time. This just says police station. It doesn't even say the RPD. <laughs> Dude, what if we knock this out really quick tonight? <laughs> Uh, you know what? I, I jinxed it. No, it's gonna get so hard, trust me. I I think we'll be able to get through the RPD. I think this is the last level of the RPD also. But I think we'll get through this relatively quickly. It's the other level is gonna be like a nightmare, trust me. I think all of the missions in the final level are like just stupid. Alright. So how does this work again? Oh yeah, they don't know I'm here. Sample obtained. Sort of. Until they do. How long does it last? Oh yeah, it's till you take damage, I think. Oh, that's unfortunate. Maybe it has a time limit on it, I don't know. This one's mine. Thought your take was the entire game is a nightmare? Well, that is true, but in a different way. It's another level of the nightmare in the... Holy crap, this is so freaking hard, what the hell is going on, kind of way. <laughs> Stomp. Oh, it's about to run out, okay. That fucking sound effect, though. I need one more sample, wait, no, 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 time out. This dog's coming at me. Get the sample! Alright. <laughs> we good, we good. Bonk. I know you love the sound effects in this game, D314. <laughs> Are they gonna even give me the jammer for this one? 
Oh, it's a wait. Oh no, this is domination, not um. Well, also the answer appears to be no, <laughs> which sucks. This would have been really nice for this one. Shit! Slap my ass. <sighs> I would like to not die, please. Okay, we're recovering. God, of course it's all the way over there. Kidney punch! Okay, there's an herb there. Oh, in fucking dog town over here. That was not where I threw- whatever, man. This gun is not great at killing those dogs. This gun does not have that dog in him. Dude, what the fuck? I didn't finish reloading, god damn it. How'd a dog get up here? What? Bullshit. Oh god! Why did I shoot that dog? He was not aggroed at all. It's an unnecessary risk. Oh shit! Freebie! Alright. Dope. Now we win. <laughs> Didn't realize that was somewhere in the level. I'm sure it's not long enough for the whole 50 seconds to last. Plus you also got to get between them and everything anyway, but... For these last two points it ought to work just fine. Oh yeah, it was just starting to spark. <laughs> They're janky as fuck. What are... Alright, I have no idea where the jammer might be this time. It's probably in here, though. That's probably like an insta-win if I can find it. Dude. Nope. It's a bad move. Okay, made it. Oh shit, this is bad. Please be an herb. That's not an herb, that's ammo. Fuck! I just pissed it all away. God damn it, dude. Ah, uh, he's eating my ass again. Unfortunate. Um. Yeah, chat, give me a second. I'm gonna go use the restroom. Can't believe you pissed it all the way.
literally pissed it all the way. Oh shit! Night Revenge, you have raided at the most unfortunate time. Even though I'm playing single player of this game, I can't pause it. As you can see, everyone just keeps moving. Uh, anyway. <laughs> One second. Thank you for the raid. How was your stream? We uh we finished Doom Eternal, the second DLC tonight, so now we're playing this. Pretty much the exact opposite. We might finish this tonight too though. We might. We got four we only have four levels left, but it gets really bad. Don't hit me. Ow. Oh, there's, there's multiple jammers in here? The heck? Just gonna shoot some defenseless dogs, no no biggie here. Okay, well that's bad. Punch them sometimes, just cause... Oh, shit. So I think you actually can break the jammer if you, uh, get hit enough times or something. I, I don't know how it works. Need my samples. I need two more. There's one here. This one's mine. Oh, nice. Thank you, D314. Let's go. Heck yeah. I don't know if you're familiar with this. Oh, Night Revenge! Fuck! I can't believe I told you this yet. I, um... I... I... There it is. No, wait, that's not it! That's a fucking... Oh, God. I'm probably dead, actually. This is what I should have done last time, I think. There's a jammer. Got my jammies. I don't know if that unaggroes the dogs that were already aggroed at me. I guess we're about to find out. They don't appear to be chasing me, though. You, you. Oh, sorry. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> uh -huh. I uh, finally bought GTFO. <laughs> which is probably an infinitely better game than this is, even though I've never played it. You know what's depressing? The, the thought I just had while I took a break a second ago? Uh... This is not only not not the worst um, shooter game I own. It's not even the worst Resident Evil shooter that I own. <laughs> so I own a copy of Gun Survivor 2 Code Veronica. <laughs> I'll, let I'll, ah, I'll let the team know. Hell yeah. Dude, I haven't co-streamed with anyone in like a long ass time. It's been a hot minute. I think Resident Evil 5 co-op was maybe the last thing I did. That was like ages ago. Fun times. Not the time that you and I did it, Night Revenge. The time that me and someone else did it. Someone else who no longer streams on Twitch. Rip that person. Why am I going the wrong way? Ah! There's no time! So it looks like there's two jammers per, uh, per level here. You know what, actually, just fuck you guys, in case you want to, like, aggro at me once my thing breaks. Boom, 50. Time that perfectly. This is a weird situation where the first two missions are incredibly free, and then, like, the get the cases is the hard one. <laughs> Missed the rando races. We only did one of them! But did, did we do another one? Sorry, I don't know why I'm mad mad about that. I too would like to do more rando races. If only people existed that played Resident Evil randomizers. I can guarantee you I would have got smoked if we ever did another one though. Like from uh a certain point onward, because I mean <laughs> he was just spamming fucking randomizer content. Well it depends which randomizer, I guess, but. Oh, 
race him in an Elden Ring randomizer. <laughs> I think I'll win out on that one. Ooh, an herb. Nice. I don't think those stay forever, though. Dude, I don't... I don't know if there is a jammer. I would really love it if there was, but... Fucking hell, dude. I don't think I can throw that far. I stand corrected. I threw too far, actually. I can hold it to, like, aim better, I think. Oh, there it is. There it is. This one's mine. All right, we win. Auto win. I choked so hard on this last time. I mean, we didn't find the jammer, so that's part of it, but... That's so, that's so free once you get the jammer. But that's not a bad gimmick round, actually. Maybe just one, but it's so epic it counts a multiple in my heart. Aw. Uh, we didn't beat our previous time. So I've already... I, I don't know why I first playthrough tagged on this. I've already beat this, but I beat it off stream, so I wanted to... For posterity, I wanted to record myself playing this. Also, I found out tech in this game that works way better. <laughs> that I didn't know about when I beat this single player. Are we still in the RPD? Okay, no, no. We're, okay, we are now in the last section. We've got three missions left, chat. Okay, so... Things have changed. My newest order is kill 3A7 within an experiment. Two reasons for that. The first being that we've perfected the jo zombie jammer. The zombie jammer. Uh, <laughs> uh, the second is that we can't have you lowering the stock of B stock on BOWs. Don't take it personally. Uh, that experiment was supposed to kill you. Just what the hell are you? I begged my superiors for another chance, and they gave it to me. Uh, but if you don't kick the bucket, then it'll be my head on the chopping block. All right, beginning of the end. An apt title for this fucking game. Uh, okay, it's a three three parter as usual. Domination at the end, cause fuck me, I guess. I don't know. You perfected the zombie jammer, so we're done with you. The final quarantine zone is the Antarctic base. Mutated zombies here don't give a shit about your little jammer. A fitting burial ground. <laughs> Yeah, there's a game mode where um, all the players start with a zombie jam. I think that's actually the standard game mode in this game, if you if you were playing multiplayer. Um, but you, I think you can shoot the jammer, like, without killing the player. I don't know why you would do this, but then, then the zombies will aggro at them. And I feel like you just shoot the player. It's, again, this game's not well designed by any measure, so... <laughs> Yeah, I think you need at least six people to play a game of this. But I am pretty sure that the online still works. I've only got... wait. Oh, we got a special infected. Try to avoid him, I guess. There it is. There it is. Okay, melee still works. Dude, I just- I think I just didn't know about this melee. Because like, there's, there's this melee weapon, which sucks ass. But then there's like... I'm sorry, what? <laughs> what is this killer? What the fuck? <laughs> what is that? I think the monster's in there. This one's mine. I'll just sit here and farm samples where the monster won't attack me. Like, alright, we kind of know the tech to fight the special infected now. But we also kind of got fucked up in the last, uh, in, our, in the RPD when we had to do it. So I don't know, man. I think sometimes it doesn't work. And I bet this monster's tougher than the previous levels because it's the end of the game. This song is actually kind of cool. I can't believe I said something positive about this game. Sample obtained. <laughs> No! Oh god, that does so much damage. Why? I feel like I still might die from one of their slaps at this point. Get over here, you. Dude, I fucking shot you. Aggro at me. They don't give a shit. Okay, that guy kind of cared, I guess. There, there's the guy that cares about killing me. Oh, that was it. That was the last one. Maybe just one, but it's so epic. Counts. Oh, never mind. <laughs> you read your comment in a different context, as usual.
Anyone feeling nostalgia for the game that they're paying homage to? Do you even fucking recognize it? <laughs> Where is the beast? Okay, he's right there. So he's in the middle of like all of these. That sucks. That really sucks, actually. <laughs> We still got another game mode after this, too. Or, like, another mission to finish the level. Wait, is this a real gun? Can I have an actual gun for this? Yes! Oh, just kidding. This is, like, fucking nerf darts. This is this a fucking flashbang? What does this do? Oh, it's an incendiary. I hate the missions where they give you the incendiary. Like, I, all it really does is it, like... Weakens the zombies a bit before they get to you, which is not completely useless, but it's pretty fucking useless. It also aggro's them all at you, so you know, have fun with that. Was really doing every game in Unity here. <laughs> What's up, Anchor Light Forge? How you doing? Good one. I saw Awesome actually sent me this. I saw a fucking person doing a marathon of every game on Steam. I don't know how they're orchestrating that, because that sounds expensive. It's not like you can... Maybe they are stealing? I don't know. <laughs> Stealing's a strong word. Oh, what? No, it's not there! It's underneath the grid! How do I get there? They're coming for me. Oh, uh, how do I crawl? Of course it's C in this game. Okay, I just need to get that last one. It's unfortunately right next to the monster. But I'm ready. Bitch! Suck on that. Got him. This one's mine. It simply is impossible. This is an homage? <laughs> yeah, it's an homage to Snake. Do you want to know? Oh man, he's right there. It's a terrible starting place, man. Is he after me? Okay, yes, uh, it is Code Veronica. We are in the Antarctic base. Jesus, okay, we killed him. Thank God he dropped the herb. These zombies do a ton of damage, too. It's like, it's not like, oh, I'm safe now, because he's dead. There's 50 zombies here, and they will all fuck me up in, like, two hits. This thing goes beyond the RE series. Oh, no, no. <laughs> I think that's the mutant respawning. Yep, sure is. Did he spawn next to my next spot? Is that where he is now? Uncertain. I think he might be on the other side of that door, which is where my next thing is, of course. God damn it. Every game Steam gets something like. A, every year on Steam gets like 10,000 games. Yeah, I don't know what his like stipulations are. Oh, fuck, man! No, do not begin transmission. Begin, get the fuck out of here. Dude, I... Shh. Shh. Again, I don't know... Don't know what his stipulations are. But there is a person doing that out there. Anyway, point is, I saw... I found out about him because he was making a video on a game that was, like, this fucking, like, awful... Goddamn... 
neo-Nazi propaganda game. <laughs> it was called, like, something the Alamo. Not not Remember the Alamo, but like a, a pun on Remember the Alamo. I was like, what the fuck is this game? <laughs> the what? Yeah. <laughs> And I'm not saying that lightly, like, oh, this guy is, you know, kind of conservative, he's a Nazi. No, like, literally, like, quoting propaganda from neo-Nazis in the game. <laughs> Last time I saw that angle of steam, it was a VTuber. Internet's wild. It sure is. Kind of figure, like, this one's mine. I know the meme, like, ever you can upload anything to Steam and whatever. But like there there is some quality control there, but that guy got through apparently, or whoever the whatever fucking asshole made that shit. This got through too. Surely it's for historical purpose. Well, okay, the thing is it's like It's played off very comedic. So it's like, oh well is he parodying it or not? But it's clear that the person played through the entire game, and it becomes clear that it is not like, haha, isn't this wacky? It's actually just literal fucking propaganda. I'm actually glad I can't remember the name of it, because I don't wish to draw any attention to that thing. <laughs> I guess I gave some info that you could probably find it, but you know, whatever. It was a cool video. <laughs> This guy's like, yeah, uh, no one should ever play this. <laughs> and not because it's bad, but it is bad, but also it, you shouldn't play this because... <laughs> <laughs> I'm going for it. I fucking missed! <laughs> I went for it, and I failed. AMA. Oh, he broke it again! I don't know what that does! <laughs> I legitimately don't know if that affects me in any way, because the zombies don't... As, as the beginning of the level said, the zombies don't give a shit about your jammer anymore, so who cares? Oh, you've seen it. <laughs> there you go. That my nose is like crazy itchy today, I don't know what... All right, time for hell. Time for pure hell. Of course it's right there. That's probably like not random. <laughs> now, now that I'm thinking about it. Fuck, man. Alright, we killed him. Uh, I feel like... Maybe that increases the aggro range or something? I don't know, man. Makes them more aggressive? Something? Oh, thank god. Like, they probably wouldn't bother putting it in there if it did nothing, right? He's right behind me! Dude, I'm so dead. <laughs> it's so, it's so Jover. That didn't even fully heal me? What the fuck? Oh, I got him, but this guy's gonna kill me. Oh wait, he dropped the thing. God damn it, get the- Oh god, I got the health, but took damage immediately. Dude, there's like 80 of them chasing me. How am I supposed to do anything about this? If only I had real grenades and not fucking frag grenades, man. Another heal, like that. Okay, they're back. I fucking hate that. No! Oh, that melee should have killed her. Yeah, but the problem is... There are impressionable people out there. <laughs> and... Like, sample up 
obtained. Like, I'm sure, you know, you viewing that and you're like, okay, well... It's intriguing to see how these fucking, like, actual trash human beings think or whatever. But, like... Rando... Completely, like, impressionable... Ah! Whether it be a child or a childlike adult. Suddenly just like, you know, yeah, I'm making some, some good points. And then the world becomes shittier. There it is. Not to mention, like, buying something like that, you know, you're literally directly supporting them in some fashion. What's even crazy about the game is it might be the reason why- Oh, sorry, this game- Yeah, let's get back on this game. <laughs> no, that game we were talking about is why Capcom's so insistent about RE multiplayer being bundled with every game, yeah. I don't understand that at all. Like, I- okay, no, I do- okay. I understand it from one angle, right? <laughs> They're looking to make, you know, insert random game that has become a cash cow that's an online game. You know, Valorant, uh... Fucking give me the thing. Uh... Fortnite is as outdated as that is, I guess. Like, any online multiplayer game that could have longevity. But they half-ass it so bad, like, every single time. I don't understand. Where do you think Umbrella got their funding from? So led to this. You'll find something else down the rabbit hole, courtesy of the algorithm, based on the hellscape we live in. Also true. This is why... Never mind. <laughs> I was gonna say something very troubling. So this is why we have alcohol. But I mean that entirely, jokingly. Do not abuse substances, chat. I say as I am drinking. Dude, I feel like I took a hit there. Like my pack took a hit or something. Oh, he's on me. Oh, he's on me. What are you climbing? What the fuck? Get out of there. <laughs> Whatever, that one's easy. That one's free. This one's just gonna take forever, man. <laughs> I feel like it gets worse after this, which is the, the really unfortunate part. But maybe I'm just misremembering it. Maybe this is the part that's just, like, insanely difficult. And then the rest are, like, not as bad. I'm sure they're bad. Do you see me? I need you to not see me. Is he even taking damage right now? <laughs> Bro's actually just up in the flames like, yeah, whatever, this is fine. Oh yeah, love me some good cheese. No. Nope. Yes. <laughs> I think I kind of understand the hitbox of that now. I don't know though. Probably don't. I hate that I have to fight this motherfucker like multiple times throughout this level. This is really trash. Oh god, it's over there. We got better RNG the first time in here. Can I not go up that? Oh, I have to go up this part. Okay. Maybe they aren't actually aggroed at me, and I was completely mistaken. So there's an herb in the vents on the upper floor. It's good to know. Is this weapon still up here? It is not still up here. Unlucky. Definitely need me some of that. 
He's right there. Why did I do that? That's a really, really bad idea. I can't, I can't. Fuck, dude. I'm dead. I'm so dead. It's so Jover. Where's the man? I'm scared. I don't think he can get over here any other way. There. Because he can't open doors. Oh, God, no. How did he even do that, man? Dude, this is so fucked. I'm, I'm so fucked. What the fuck was that, man? Oh, God. Thank you for the herb, man. Yeah, before we even, like, started capturing the second point, our pack broke. I think that's a bad sign. God damn it, man! What the fuck? What the fuck? Any of them respawned? <laughs> yeah, this is where the game's just like, you know what? Fuck you. That's literally what's happening in the plot of the game. But that doesn't mean that the game needs to play that way. <laughs> it's... Back to part one! It's fucking cunts that made this game, like, hey, what if we made three parts? Oh yeah, just slap me in the face, please. Cool. <laughs> hey, eat my asshole. To beat the zombies, you gotta think like the zombies. God. It's so fucking bad. Three more levels, chat. Including this one. in this mode that this guy were at least worth more than one. Please not. <laughs> Pardon me. Well, now we're free to go wherever, I guess. Should make this a little quicker. Well, that's not at all what I wanted to do. Thank you. Oh, shit. Dude... <laughs> How unlucky can I be? Well, that's the monster. Surprise. This one's mine. So, a little bit of bullets and then three slaps will kill him, it seems. Dude, I can't believe we're not at 20 yet. Are you not dead? He's dead. Give me the thing, give me the thing. What is that? That's the ladder. <laughs> Bitch. Got him. jams when I'm near the guy. Oh, fuck! <laughs> no, that's my spidey sense. It knows that, I, that I've aggroed him. Bitch. Alright. Motherfucker. How's he not dead? What the fuck? It took like five slaps that time. Back to hell. What the fuck does that button do? Did you guys 
just fuck off? Dude, fucking stop! Why are you not stopping? I'm looking down as much as I possibly can. Okay, we actually don't need to waste any ammo here. Except on that guy. But he a dick. say some good RNG at last, but then that guy spawned literally next to the spawn point and slapped me in the face before I could literally do anything. Where is he? Must always spawn like near where the next one is or where the current one is. Something, I don't know. Some bullshit. I already grabbed that by accident. Damn it. Oh, it's up there. Man. I do really wish melee was reliable, but it ain't. Where is the boy? I'm scared. I don't know where he is. Oh, he's down there. Okay, I see. No, that's not him. Fuck, oh, dude. That's scary. No! Is that in the same spot? It is? Okay. This could be it. No. Nobody's gonna break in my stride. Dude, we got the god seed of, like, him respawning. I don't know what the fuck happened, but I'm taking it. <laughs> fuck yeah, finally. Two more levels. <laughs> How bad could it be? The final battle, but also that's not the final battle, because there's one after it. Uh, Chad, I gotta, I gotta take a break again. Be right back, and we'll do the next one.
the final battle, even though it isn't. Uh, commencing experiment. Survival expectancy is 0%. We've got to show just how threatening B.O.W.s can be. After all, there are those who are banking everything on them. So all you have to do is die. Basically the same shit they said in the last thing. <laughs> Fucking hell, why won't you die? Are you human? You're not the Grim Reaper, are you? I don't want to die. I still have another chance. God. <laughs> it ends. Oh my god. At least the first one's collected. That shouldn't be too bad. But it ends with hunting the special infected. <laughs> oh, we have a weapon. We actually have a real weapon, though. That's cool. We know how to cheese them, actually, so maybe this won't be as bad. I don't know. I'm gonna regret those words, probably. <laughs> so, 3A7, what happens when you kill monster after monster? Eventually, you become one of them. But it ends now. You'll be joining Alexia in eternal slumber here. You wish. Wait, did, where does Alexia die? It's not here, is it? I guess, Oh, yeah, I know it is. That's right. It is in the Antarctic base. There's so much back and forth in Code Veronica. <laughs> the final battle. This will be miserable. I think the last mission actually is just one thing, though. So that should hopefully be not as bad. That special man right there, I think. Yeah, you are special, man. He didn't aggro on me just now, did he? Where is that one? Oh, yeah, there's the second floor. I remember now. Dogs? Dear God. Like I said, though, there are no birds here. <laughs> Doesn't make the area not annoying, but... It could be worse. It could actually be worse, somehow. That's not how you get up there. That's how you get up there. They can't grab anything after the round ends. I can still shoot stuff, though. God, five minutes? <laughs> or like six minute clear time? This does not bode well. Well, shit. Actually, wait. We might be good. Can I see how powerful this weapon is? Oh, fuck, dogs. No! Dude, fucking ass. What the- How did you aggro? Well, we're, we're about to redo right now, because uh, that's really fucking bad. It's happened in the first two- I haven't even, like, seen the capture point yet. Oh, it's up here. That kind of sucks ass, too, but... Wait, how do I get up there? Oh, shit. Oh, it's the other pillar. Damn it. It's a jank-ass architecture. Dude, I don't know how that thing aggroed on me, though. It's kind of fucked. Let's <laughs> just, just go. Just run. Ooh, got him, bitch. I'm gonna punch you to death now. Because I can. Give me a better spot this time. They did not. They refuse. What the f dude. No, he aggros. Why? Why do you aggro from that? Why won't you climb that? What the fuck is this level, man? 
<laughs> Bitch. Fuck you. Fuck you too. Well, that's bad. <laughs> that dog... Did he lose aggro? No, he did not. Okay. Okay, well, the, the guy's over there. That's good. That is a good thing. We still have to kill three of these guys after this, which is going to be fun. This gun's pretty good, actually. That does, in fact, inspire confidence. In the long-term goal of killing these guys later. Although it doesn't have a lot of bullets in it, I will say that. He's still aggroed at me. I'm gonna have to deal with that at some point. Or maybe he de-aggroed somehow? I don't know. You gotta you gotta believe I'm fucking nervous as hell about the last round. Like, this is round two. <laughs> and also we got kinda lucky there too. Except for that, that was nonsense. <laughs> Ten more seconds and we're out of here. Under the final level. Final challenge of this. Which we may have to redo if we die. Hopefully we don't die. Probably goes without saying. <sighs> if I can get them on that ledge, I can like cheese them. We Oh, we start here, that's good. This is good for that. Okay, this is bad, because I don't know where he is. He's up there, isn't he? I think that's him. That's a dog. Did I aggro him? I don't even know. Come on, you big bitch. Oh, we got him, we got him, we got him. Okay. Hold on. Oh shit! He broke out! Contain the sample! I waste a heal. That's unfortunate. I don't know why you're a part of this. Get out of here, you! It's gonna be him. It's gonna be him. It's totally gonna be him. How much ammo do I have? Alright, two. One more, please, God. Let me sink this. Oh shit, I aggroed somebody. Where are they? Oh. It's that dog. Come on, respawn. Okay, he's over there. That's good. Can maybe cheese this? Get cheesed, fucking idiots. Learn to code a game, bitches. Oh, first try. Well, not first try, but first try on the last round. 
All right, one more level, Chad. <laughs> Shaved a minute off our time too. Hell yeah. Please let this be a normal field trip. I forget what the last level's like. It's probably the worst out of all of them. The previous work researcher was dismissed. I'll be taking over regarding the further experimental trials of subject 33A7. Oh, there, there are three sections to this. Oh no, that's a time. Okay. So we're in the B territory currently. Guess someone upstairs hates me. You're still alive. Of course you are. The researchers, they're afraid of you. They started calling you the new Grim Reaper. Yeah, there are three. Collect the samples, collect the samples, collect the samples. This experiment, it was the most difficult one I could create. It wasn't supposed to matter what equipment you had. Survival expectancy was supposed to be year zero, and yet, why? Buckle in chat, this might be a nightmare actually. <laughs> We'll see. It's three collect the DNA. But this is the last level at least. Oh, what do I what equipment do I have? Okay, is that the gun from last time? Because that was a pretty good gun. I think it is. At the very least it's something automatic, which is cool. This one's mine. Yeah, keep spawning, please, actually. That'd be awesome. I think the special infected may be aggroed. But he's on the other side of that wall. And he's not moving. Oh, wait, no, he might be moving, actually. Hold on. <laughs> Shit. Yep, he's moving. Dude, it sounds like there's a dog aggroing at me, but it's not. Or there isn't. <laughs> that guy, like, stopped aggroing. Somehow, for some reason. Yeah, that's him. Okay, fuck. Get away from that. I missed the sample, didn't I? Is he aggroed? He is not aggroed. Okay. Risky to open this, but whatever. We're on round one anyway. It's not like it matters. Surprise! There it is. What the fuck? Just happened there. All right, round one is done. We got two more, Chad. Two more of these, and then we're actually done with the fucking game. Okay, different starting point. Fuck. Sample obtained. My thing's sparking. Is he chasing me? Yep, he found me. Okay, fuck. This one's mine. Dude. Why are there 80 zombies in here, dude? Fuck off! No! No! You showed him how to get to me, you fuck! You betrayed me! Oh, that's bad! Oh, bad! I'm out of ammo. Fuck. That's really bad. Wait, we need 30 samples this time. Wait, no, we always need 30 samples. Or do we? I don't know, man. 
Is there ammo somewhere around here? It's a dog here. What the fuck? That dog was like, hey, I know you're gonna try to this, so I'm gonna get out of your way. Ammo up here, maybe? Don't grab it yet. Switch to your gun. Your real gun. Because you know that motherfucker's coming back soon. We gotta be ready. If he finds us, which he probably will. Eventually, anyway. Or not. I'll take that too, honestly. I don't care. Oh no, he found us! Oh fuck, I led him into... Oh shit, dogs! Dude! That's bad. That's really bad, actually. That's cover. That's not what I need. I'm dead. I don't know how I'm not dead yet. Emphasis on yet. Fuck these dogs, man. Where did he go? Where is the fucking man of the hour? This one's mine. One more, one more. Dude, I wish you- I don't know why you can't go up that, but it's probably the same reason that guy gets glitched on it, so, you know? <laughs> it's like... Alright, last one. Please, God. Free me from the slammer. Okay, he's right there. I'm gonna hope he doesn't auto-aggro at me or something. This one's mine. I think he might have done that. I don't really want that. Stand up, asshole. Sample obtained. I should have left that herb there. Oh, fuck! Fuck. Okay. I do appreciate that they always drop a uh, health. That helps a lot. Sample obtained. Somebody's spawning in somewhere. It's a dog. There it is. Okay. There's the man. Is he aggroed? I can't tell actually. It's sparking. I think he's aggroed. I don't know where he is though, which is really fucking scary. We need 40 this time. Okay, shit. It is going up. Wait, he's up there. I guess it sparks when he's near me, not necessarily when he's aggroed at me. I don't know. I know I just used a grenade on that, but I don't think I want to go over there. Uh -oh. I think he might have aggroed. Do I need ammo, though? I need to know where ammo drops are, I guess. Um, I haven't found any yet. It's a huge fucking problem. I think he just wandered out there. I don't think he's actually aggroed. There's some. Dude, come on, man. Oh, god damn it. I had to, man. Can't risk another, like, bad dog. Bad dog. <laughs> bad dog bite. Only dogs are spawning, man. It's fucked up. No! Ah, oh, you bitch. Dude, where did he even fucking come from? What was that? 
Sorry for the yell. This is very visceral. Well, that's bad. No! Go up! Go up there! Jesus Christ, dude! No! Another, another dog! Sample obtained. This is really fucking bad. Dude! God, man. Sample obtained. It's all dogs! Why is it all dogs? Give me some fucking zombies or something. I don't know. Something slower. Give me a second to breathe. So it wasn't even the special guy that got me. Yeah, it is. It was just like something got me. No, 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 no. Dude, you fucking ran over here. Nine more. I'm gonna glitch the fuck out of this. I don't give a shit, man. <laughs> I wonder. I probably found this in my first. I don't remember this level that much, which is weird. I remember it taking forever to finish this, but I don't remember which level specifically. Oh shit. You hit me. It's bad. Oh, giving her. That's good. I'm just glad the special guy hasn't, like, aggroed yet. Or if he has, he doesn't know how to get to me. Four more. Please, God. I thought there was someone spawning there. Oh, there is. Oh, he found me. Fuck. No, no, no. Stay this way. Someone spawning in. Oh, God. It's gonna come for me. One more. Good doggy. Oh, I love this dog. Thank you, dog. Hey, G. Motherfucking Gs. We beat the goddamn game. We're done with this. There. Now, the, the thing that nobody asked for, Umbrella Core. Oh, we were a minute and a half slower because I was using that stupid glitch for like two of the challenges. Especially the last one was really slow. This thing that nobody asked for is now completed. <laughs> Sadly, we don't... Oh, wait, we can see the credits if I go to credits. But also... Alright, hold on. I didn't do training, or maybe I did do training, I don't know. Let's see if it tells me any of this stuff. It probably tells me how to melee. We're gonna do the tutorial just for posterity, I don't know. But we beat the game. These parents have been designed to weed out those who will be of no use to us. They will most likely die during the training. Well, lab rat, which one are you? I'll die. During the training. Even though I just beat the whole game. <laughs> G motherfucking G's chat. We are done with Umbrella Core, but I'm gonna I'm gonna do the training just for funsies. I don't think I actually did do this, unless there's an achievement to do it. In which case I did do it. Zombie jammer. The jammer will allow you to move free of zombie perception. Fuck. Sound radar. Relays information such as gunshots, footsteps to the player. Your position will be displayed at a solid triangle, while your teammates will be uh, triangle outlines. Kill three zombies with your main weapon. One, two, three. Oh, sub weapon? One, two. Analog aim. What a weird way to word that. What? What do you want from me? Why did it teleport me? Whoa! <laughs> nice zombie shield, she's just fucking biting me. You can only do it when they're facing you? Why? <laughs> Crouch. Crawl. Melee attack. Oh, they do. They do teach you the melee attack. Yeah, I, I definitely didn't do this. Because <laughs> I didn't know about that. Status icon, vitality meter, status. Capcom. Oh, that's the player name. <laughs> Zombie jammer effect, status icon. Well, what do you think that stands for, chat? This one's mine. <laughs> Says your HP stats, equipment, 
can fill your team. The icon will be visible over your head to your teammates. I show icon. I didn't know this was icon will allow you to communicate with your teammates. Icon will be visible over your head. Show icon. But it's not working. I can't do it. Nice tutorial, jackass. Kill the zombie with a grenade. Oh my god. How am I gonna do this? Complete. I don't know why I decided to do the tutorial after beating the game, but hey, you know. <laughs> Whatever. Advanced training now. Let's do that one. YOLO. This advanced training shows us the subject's true potential. It also determines whether the lab rat lives or dies. Life or death in this arena, they're almost the same anyway. I'll pull up the credits after this, and then we'll laugh at how many people worked on this shitty game. <laughs> or whatever, I don't know. Oh, I'm so glad to be done with this. <laughs> Kill three zombies while undercover. <laughs> Doorway to hell. <laughs> Switch to the brainer. Okay, so I will say this, this thing sucks, but I did play this, um, online once, and it, like, insta-kills players. It's, it's vaguely interesting what they were doing here, because I feel like they were trying to, um, oop, it's still heated. They were trying to, like, curb complaints people had about, like, Call of Duty. At the time, we're like, oh, the fucking... Use your tactical shield with the handgun or brainer equipped to have them bite into it. You can use the zombie as a shield. Use it for too long, the zombie will attack. Cool. That's why we never had the prompt. You just have to get to face them. What the hell? Oh yeah, that was the thing. We did that a couple times, I guess. Moving on up. These are the advanced techniques, by the way. Just traversing the level. Wall crawl here. I like the tutorial music. Shut her away. That's all. That's all the advanced tutorial. <laughs> okay. But yeah, the brainer actually does damage in the. Um, what's going on in here? Welcome, Carly. We just finished another game. You're here. You just get here when we finish games. <laughs> I'm actually about to wind down. We finished Umbrella Core, or at least we finished the experiment, which is the single-player version of Umbrella Core. There are these other side missions. I don't care about them. <laughs> I just don't care. Whatever. I've done them already, as you can see. They're just they're just the same level rehashed, and I think there's enough of that already in the game. We got to the end. We beat it. The end. This game's absolute trash. As I said before, this game is worse. No, wait, not this game. Not this game, because this is Resident Evil 4 and Code Veronica. That's a good game. This game is trash. Hold on. This is this. I hold in my hand the only game worse than Umbrella Core. This fucking piece of shit game. This is. If you can't see this, this is Gun Survivor 2 Biohazard Code Veronica. There you go. Clock Tower 2. Clock Tower 2 is worse than that. I have that here too. Um, oh, it's over there. Never mind. It's behind the. It's behind the green screen. Yeah. No, sorry. This. This is. This is the only Resident Evil game that's worse than this one. <laughs> like first party proper Resident Evil, by Capcom. They made this. Well, okay. I think they actually may have made the one I was just holding up. They. They did not make this. They outsourced this game. Happy fucking twenty. 20th anniversary Resident Evil. Here's the shitty game. Uh, yeah. As you, I mean, you just saw those different team all together that made this. But 
obviously published by Capcom, it's their IP, whatever. Okay, you know what? Stray Light was made with five people. This was made by like seven programmers, but there's like several dozen people involved here. And actually, Stray Light was made by two programmers for the record. <laughs> and we also did many other things. I guess, me personally, I probably did the most like just coding and other, not other stuff, but I mean, I was on support threads with people and I don't know, stuff around like porting. I did a lot of interaction with like other external companies and stuff. They had mocap. That's true. Graphically, this game is more technically impressive than Straylight, I will say that. Gameplay wise, I I am not one to, to jerk myself off. I'm not saying Straylight's the greatest thing to grace this earth, but uh I I think no contest Straylight is a more fun game than this. <laughs> Easily. <laughs> So I have made a better game than this, in, in short. Fuck all these people, all of you, you fucked up. I mean, QA really doesn't, you know, they just test the game. It's not like they can do anything about it. Like, oh, this game is shit. Uh, okay, well, we got to ship it, so whatever. <laughs> Does it work? Yeah, okay, well. I will say that. Other than that glitch in the last level, which saved our ass, by the way, that would have taken us, like, probably two more hours if I hadn't found that. Uh... Maybe not that long, but it would have taken us like a lot longer to do the last couple of challenges if I hadn't found that glitch where the AI just gets stuck on that ledge. <laughs> uh, but other than that, like the game is actually not glitchy. I have I have to call that out because I'm gonna use that as a springboard to highlight all the things that are just wrong about this game in general. Like the game is still crap, even though it's like solid, <laughs> you know? It's just not fun. Much of the single player was just garbage checkboxes to skip the alongside the multiplayer. Yeah, that's very true. I and that that is a very fair point. This game is multiplayer focused. We played the single player, and obviously that's not what they wanted people to play. That was again, like literally, like you said, there's a checkbox to say this game has single player. You can play it offline. But I mean, the multiplayer sucks too. I've played the multiplayer. It's it's better, but that is not a compliment. <laughs> that's all I have to say. I no, I've gotten the real experience. I have played this with people. <laughs> like I, I know what multiplayer is like. Chat's not getting the real experience, that's true. I never streamed that, but you know. I think Capcom really sent this game off to die, and I saw the response to be honest. Yeah, that's fair. Maybe that's what's happened with all the like PvP games they've released. I I'm gonna go alright, this might be controversial. I don't know. I I am not praising either of these games. But Resistance and Reverse are way better than this game. <laughs> They're not good games. I, I kind of okay. I kind of like Reverse. I gotta be honest. Not, not sorry. No, 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 not Reverse. I kind of like Resistance. I kind of like that game. But I, I say this often. It is probably nostalgia for a weird. I know that game's like not that old, <laughs> but it's nostalgia in the sense that it is very much similar to an old. Half-Life 2 mod, or Source Engine mod that I used to play called Zombie Master. It is like the same type of game, but the AAA version of that. And it's just as horribly balanced as the fan-made one was, and all that stuff. Reverse made you completely... made you a completely person. <laughs> Reverse is dumb fun. It's terrible, but it's very fun, and I, that's the best thing I have to say about it. <laughs> Reverse was hilarious. I'm glad you guys enjoyed that. I enjoyed playing it. I'm never going to play it again. <laughs> Made you a completely different person. <laughs> gotcha. Capcom has no issue sending a game out early if it's not ready and not going all the way. Yeah, that does happen in some pockets of Capcom. I agree. Um, I... I don't want to, like, get down and start fucking... blowing a AAA company, but... I have to give Capcom some credit. They're one of the few, like, reputable AAA developers on the whole. Again, is Reverse good? No. Is Resistance good? No. But as far as their main releases go, like Resident Evil 4 Remake is awesome. Fight me, I don't fucking care. Village was awesome. RE3 Remake was a disaster. It's it's a good game, but it's it was it was fucked. Like, alright, there's fucked up problems with RE3 Remake. RE2 Remake, fantastic game. Uh yeah, no, no. I 
Uh, no, I think there's really good quality to RE3. It's just a fucking ripoff. Like, RE sorry, RE3 remake. Um, you haven't finished it. Damn, it's the shortest one. That's the, that's the main problem. There's, there's nothing in it. It's so fucking short and linear. It's everything that the original one wasn't. <laughs> uh, I mean, the, sorry, no, the original one was too short. I, let's, let's be real. R3 original, too short. But it had good replayability. R3 Remake has no replayability. It's fucking trash for that. Uh, hated its encounters so much. I think the first, like, two hours of gameplay in RE3 Remake on your first playthrough. Like, when you're going around the city, you have Nemesis chasing you. It was everything that was in the demo, and that was the best stuff. I think that's where the game shines. Uh, the storytelling is solid, even if it's simplistic. Like, I don't want to champion any story for any Resident Evil game. They're all kind of trash at the end of the day, but, like, I think they took the framework of RE3 Original and enhanced it pretty well. I, this might be a hot take. I don't know. I'm probably pissing some of you off by saying this. The gameplay is good. Yeah, no, that's that's true. No, I totally get it. I I am also mad about RE3 Remake. Let me make that clear. I don't, I don't, I am not happy about how RE3 Remake turned out. And I'm very cautious. Capcom's talking about they might make the next RE Remake maybe a non, um, non mainline remake, which to me, I interpret that as they're going to make Code Veronica again. And Code Veronica is an incredibly fucking long game. I love Code Veronica. Uh, they are gonna cut corners with that. Like, RE4 Remake? RE4 is also a really long game, and RE4 Remake's even longer somehow. <laughs> um, but, that's like one of the, like, not even in the Resident Evil universe, that game is one of the most revered, like, games of that era. Like, people worship that game that have never touched another Resident Evil, and will never touch another, another Resident Evil. So, all eyes were on them when they said, hey, we're gonna remake that. Code Veronica is incredibly niche. Some people fucking hate that game, and I get it. It's, it's, it's very rough around the edges. It's not it's not great. Well, okay. There are things that are great in Code Veronica, but it has it has fundamental design flaws that can create a really shitty gameplay experience when playing through it. Um, but because of that, it's, it's another black sheep, much like Resident Evil 3, for different reasons. And I have no confidence if that's actually what they're going to remake next, that they're actually going to do it right. <laughs> Chance we'll get Revelations 1 remake instead. I would love that, actually. Revelations 1 is a game that really grew on me very slowly. The first playthrough, I kind of didn't like the game at all. But the more I've, like, replayed it and done, like, extra side content and stuff on it, like, it's actually really solid. I think raid mode is, uh, way too much. Um, that was so fucking grindy to get all the achievements in raid mode. But, you know, otherwise... I, I would love a Revelations 3, personally. Like, go forward. I know they're, they're talking about remakes... I, I guess I probably should have started with this. I, fucking stop the remakes, everyone. Capcom does the best remakes. Resident Evil Three remake aside, like they are, they they have honed their skills because they've been re-releasing shit for like decades at this point. How many fucking versions of R of RE Two, Street Fighter Two are there, Chad? Uh, they they know what they're doing in this wheelhouse. I know it's completely separate teams and stuff like that, but from a top-level business strategy level, I think they understand what to do. Stray Light Remake when? The game came out this year, Carly. It hasn't even been a full year. Um, I, but I would love to see new stuff instead. And they are talking... They, there's also been rumors about like what they want to put in Resident Evil 9. That's cool. Can't wait for that. I'm excited. Be honest, are you for make? I was saying completely unnecessary. Now that's here, and really showed me are you for story and made it 10 out of 10. Dude, fuck yes. Anchor Life Forge, 100 percent agree. I was you can you can find streams, like stream uploads from me that I was like, oh man, like you don't really need to remake Resident Evil 4. It's really solid and it has like an there's a fan HD port of it, like it's on modern systems. It's not like it's locked on like a console or anything like that. Like it didn't need to be remade. But I am very happy with what they delivered. I think they managed to retain the spirit of the original while giving a very unique twist on it. It was very cool. Oh yeah, no, yeah. Lewis for sure. That weirdly made me think of some other topics that I'm not gonna get into. <laughs> but uh, I'll, I'll to cut it short, characterization in Resident Evil 3 Remake is probably the strongest thing in that game, which is not where I'd want them to put effort in the Resident Evil Remake game, or just a, any sort of remake ever. Who was the child again? Ashley? Yeah, Ashley. She's 18, she's legal. So funny, Shinji Mikami apparently asked to come back and refused to leave Tango. And they're basically like, make sure you rewrite the story because it sucked. 
Yeah, no. Oh my god, I read that. I've, I've, I've read that interview um, where he was like, "Yeah, like, hey, I'm disappointed in the way the story turned out for RE4 original," and that's fair. I RE4 remakes. Yeah, that is Ashley, by the way, right? <laughs> to confirm. Um, Ashley's a bit of a mixed bag in the remake. I think there's a lot of really good qualities in in her like remake characterization compared to the original. Um. Yeah, I guess that's fair. People hate her in the original. I don't know. She fits the campy vibes that games goes for in the original. Uh, I think I very often come off as like someone that hates RE4 original. I don't. I, I that's a great game. It's lower on my list. Obviously, way above this trash that we're sitting on the screen of. By the way, she's just useless. She really is, and she she has more of a purpose in the remake, which is very nice. I hate it now. <laughs> Love how useless she is. So okay, uh, I'm gonna shift gears wildly here, but I think this is actually fairly comparable in a weird way. Uh, Indiana Jones Temple of Doom. Uh, people hate. No wait. Oh uh, God, what is her name? It is Willie Scott, right? Yeah. People hate Willie. The the female lead in that movie. What is her character's name? Ah, uh, I think that's Willie Scott. Is the not the actress's name, but the character's name. I don't know any actor's name in that game, or that game, that movie, except for Harrison Ford. <laughs> so, you know, uh, like, there is a decent argument that I've heard, having not liked that one that much growing up, for, like, why she works in the context of that movie, and also as a follow-up to the, the first Indiana Jones with that has a very strong female lead. Like, she's the antithesis of that, and she is kind of useless, but it makes for an interesting, like, setup in some spots. I don't know. The biggest sour would note with RE4 remake is Ada, to be honest. Very much so. Yeah, no, I mean, I uh, actually like the new performance a lot, except the audio drops. Kind of sucked. Learn the internet did an internet. Uh, it fucking sucks what the internet did overall and, like, harassed that actress. That's awful. Um, I cannot abide by her performance. It's it's bad. I, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. I liked her writing, like, her, her like the way she was reshaped as a character. And also, the like, visually, like, she does a cool, like, redesign for her. Um... But the voice acting, I, I can't get over. It, it is, like, legitimately bad. Um, I, I did also hear that that actress apparently had, like, COVID. or She was, like, still getting over COVID or something when she was recording her lines. So, like, if that's the case, I feel really bad for her. I mean, I feel really bad for her regardless because people fucking harassed her in real life because they didn't like her performance. And again, like, that's fucking stupid. Um, but, you know, just at an objective level, like, I think that is, like, unexcusably like, bad. <laughs> Grumpy as it went on, the audio direction seemed like a mess for her. Yeah, no, that could that could be. That's the thing. It's not always like one person's fault, right? Video games are a cacophony. Of, I mean, this is true of film as well, right? Like you could you could have really shitty writing in a movie, and a great actor or actress could still like like no matter how much effort they put into it, it could still come off awful. And video games are like that times ten because like you need the visuals to sync up right, you need the writing to sound good, you need a like natural flow to like the voices, and it's you know you're not there doing it like uh, it's it's very hard even if you do like the collaborative effort that i know a lot of studios do now where you have everyone recording lines together which i don't think was the case with that because i think you know there was still some amount of like post quarantine stuff going on with remote work and stuff so it's a case fucking rip but also they should have got let her get better i agree <laughs> So amazed they didn't provide her a mic. Wait, they didn't even provide her a mic. Yeah, okay. Like again, that's another thing, right? <laughs> if you're if you're working if you're working remotely and you're making this big triple A, like I feel like opening up Resident Evil 4 remake and going to the credits right now just to show like how many people fucking worked on that game. Like you can't spare equipment for your goddamn actors and actresses. She heard, yeah, she used her home equipment. That's so that's fucking stupid, man. Uh, God, that makes me angry. <laughs> The bit that Capcom like did that to her. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. I I've said my piece. I we could go in circles all night about this. Uh, at this point, first of all, I'm gonna end the recording. We we're done. We're done with Umbrella Court. I'm happy to keep chatting about this, but um, I'm gonna end the recording. So one sec here. GG's on Umbrella Core, by the way. We beat this piece of shit, this hot turd. If we're, we're talking about things that are bad, let's look at Umbrella Core. Umbrella Core is so much worse than anything else, anything at all in Resident Evil 4 Remake. <laughs> GG's, fuck this game. We're done. <laughs>